What? That I can control it from the steering wheel? Yeah. You know, I figured I'd uh, open this one just a little bit differently than we normally open our videos, honey. Follow me along here. It was a dark and storm. I'm sorry, that's my dog. Uh, hey there, Stephen Peck from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. Always appreciate when you watch what we do. Heading up to uh, Aldi's because we haven't done Aldi's in a cup of coffee. And there's a couple of things that people have suggested we try at Aldi's. So that's where I'm going to head up to, uh, including um, uh, a knockoff of King's Hawaiian bread. Remember, honey? Yeah. One of the comments that somebody put in one of our videos, and we were talking about King's Hawaiian bread and the rolls. They said that Aldi's had a pretty good version of that. That, uh, that I'm going to pick up and try because I do love King's Hawaiian bread. Before we get into our video at Aldi's, love for you to hit the subscribe button below if you've not already done so, and the bell notification button below because that'll get you notified when we put up future videos. Love for you to hit the like button too because that'll help you out, uh, help us out rather immensely. Uh, I will say that we're going in here at, uh, at really early in the morning. They just opened up, so there's not, hopefully not a lot of people in here, but we want to do a little bit of shopping at Aldi. Find some Aldi deals too, so... We'll check out the uh, Aldi Deals aisle, or affectionately known as the Isle of Shame, um, and see what we got in here. So let's get parked, and we'll head on into Aldi's. We actually have an Aldi bag. Yeah, we. I don't know where you got the Aldi bag from, but we have an Aldi bag. And I have my Aldi quarter, too, by the way. In case you're wondering, if you've not seen an Aldi video before, you need a quarter to get a shopping cart. So we have one that we leave in all of our cars, so when we come up, all you do is you put the quarter in like that. It releases the lock there. and you can pull the cart out. Now, when you put the lock back in, it releases the quarter, so you get your quarter back. So always keep a quarter in your car. It's called an Aldi quarter, so that you can get a cart when you go to Aldi. Did you see that? Associates get 16 bucks an hour if you want to apply there. <laughs> that's more than I get right now. I know, that's a little I, scary. I should ask for a raise. I'm only working part-time, so I don't really care. I think I was going to look at strawberries because strawberry is part of the Aldi finds and our grandbabies love strawberries. Mm, $1.69 for a, what is it, a 16-ouncer? Yeah, 16-ouncer mm -hmm. here. So you pick out the strawberries. Yeah. I mean, you always look underneath the yeah. bottom because a lot of times, yeah, those look good actually. You only going to get one? No, I may get two. So there's one. And we do have frozen strawberries, but we use those for shakes. <laughs> daiquiris. Oh, okay. You, daiquiris, and me, shakes. Uh, daiquiris. And what else is here? I don't oh, know. cantaloupe. Do you like cantaloupe, honey? I do oh. like cantaloupe, actually. $1.69 for a cantaloupe. I do not know how to pick out a cantaloupe, so what I do is I just pick one and hope. Well, I usually smell it and you let it sit. So you're supposed to smell it and see if it's right. Whoa. Ooh. I don't smell a thing. Well, you can let it sit. Yeah. Just let it sit? Mm -hmm. See if it, uh... all right, we'll get one and see what it's like. Did you see this? Oh, those are the red grapes, mm -hmm. 95 cents, uh, 95 cents a pound, is that it? Yep. We just bought green grapes yesterday, yeah. and um, so we don't need to buy that, but mini cucumbers, honey. And mini bagged avocados, too. Dollar for, or four nineteen for the that's actually pricey for avocados. How many get in there? That's a six pack. That's actually not a bad price for avocados. You're right. That is a six but pack. But those are pretty tiny. Look yeah. at how small they are. Yeah. But there are mini cucumbers. Mm-hmm. A dollar ninety nine on the mini cucumbers. For one pound. Yeah. If anybody really knows how to tell me how a pick a good cantaloupe please put it in the comments below i'd love to know oh but honey mangoes 79 cents each i'm going to think i'm going to try one look at that you love mangoes i do i think we grab this one back here to wait till it ripens up okay so try a mango if you knew mango like that oh, i'm sorry what else do they got here Yeah, apples this week are a little more expensive here at Aldi versus Kroger. As you know, Kroger is having a 99 cent sale on their large apples. Mm -hmm. So it's actually cheaper to buy there. 
but I do love the fact that the pricing of broccoli. That's a good price on broccoli, $1.99 mm -hmm. for that. Per pound. We might need to make a Trader Joe's run too because I want to get some snow peas and Trader Joe's has really good snow peas. Oh, but the mushrooms is a great price here, honey. Can you pick up on some mushrooms? Yeah, I can actually. That one look good? Yeah, it does. It this is one? Mm -hmm. $1.49 okay. for eight ounces. And the baby peeled carrots, can you pick those up too? 79 cents. A yeah, I think we're out of carrots at home, aren't we? Mm -hmm. And that's a great price because usually they're 99 cents at Kroger. I saw a story on these baby carrots and a guy used to have um, a farm and the, how the baby carrots came around. He had the farm and he was trying to get, figure out how to get rid of the misshapen carrots, mm -hmm. the ones that really didn't sell. He ran them through a grinder and made baby carrots and they just took off. Now everybody's doing baby carrots. Really? But that's how it started was the guy was just trying to get rid of misshapen carrots. Um, I figured that would be a way to do it. Okay, I'm looking for the King's Hawaiian Rolls. Here what? we go. Hawaiian Sweet Rolls. There right, we are. That's it. I'm going to try these because these are supposed to be as good as King's Hawaiian. So I want to try these and see if they are. They're only $1.99. That's way cheaper than the ones. <laughs> the King's Hawaiian, yeah. And I do need more cookies. The grandkids just keep eating the cookies. Did you want to get the garlic bread for, because oh. we're doing lasagna tonight, right? Yes, we are. We tried this before. This is really, really good. So this is all you have to do. Um, there it is right there. Um, putting in the oven from thawed, four, uh, four, uh, 425, our oven 405 because uh, our oven cooks hot. But just five to seven minutes or until golden brown. Or you can cook it on the grill. Um, or you can, from freezer, it takes a little longer, but this is really, really good. So we have had that before, so that's not a new, that's not a new find for us. Here's Hawaiian half a loaf. You want to try that too? Uh, we could try it. It's only a dollar eighty-four. Make sandwiches out of this. Yeah, I just checked the date, August twentieth. That yeah. looks good. So I, again, uh, we had a suggestion. One of the comments when we were talking about King's Hawaiian rolls uh, at uh, Kroger, uh, someone put a suggestion in as a comment to try from here. So we are. There's your animal crackers. Oh, yeah, I've not seen that. Did you want to get a box? Yes. I know you like animal crackers. I love animal crackers. And they're not bad at all. But I usually do the mini alphabet crackers too. But so. honey, look on the back. Oh, I love puzzles like that, don't you? I do. I'm the guy that walks into a restaurant and say, can I have a kid's menu so I can play with all the stuff on the back? Oh, and you wanted the mini alphabet too? Yes. And it's an Aldi saver too, by the way. Does this have a game on the back? It does not. Okay, but there you go. But this is what the grandkids love. I love them too because they taste like those McDonald's cookies. Mm-hmm. Let's see if they have your um, oyster crackers because they didn't have any last time you were here. Nope, those are open nope. cookies. You're right. My oyster crackers, I still don't see them. Well, let's see if they're down here. No, I don't see them down here either. But here's a peanut butter. You can try these. No, I no, no. There's. A, I want to try the. Uh, I like the a certain type of them. I'm um, going to try them. Okay. Because they're only a dollar fifteen, you really have to try them versus the other one. Okay, I'll try them. These are made, made on saltines, so we'll give it a shot. I love peanut butter crackers. They do have a pretty darn good selection of deli meat and cheeses and uh, dips as well. So that's one thing you can find here at Aldi's. And they have fondue, honey. Cheese fondue. I've never done cheese fondue. I've done fondue, like the chocolate fondue where you dip strawberries into mm -hmm. it. And I've done 
my parents called my parents called it fondue, but it was actually a big fondue pot filled with oil, and you dump steak into it mm -hmm. and cook your steak that way. We've done that, but I've never done cheese fondue. Here's an option to buy coffee, a little bit cheaper than everywhere else because mm -hmm. what's going on with coffee prices, honey? <laughs> They're going up like you wouldn't believe. I told you they were going to. I told you a year ago they were going to go up. But this is uh, this is uh, Aldi coffee, but it's uh, what is it? What's the Beaumont Classic Roast? Six forty nine for that. It's still kind of pricey though. Six. Uh, so it's thirty point five ounces. Mm -hmm. And the Columbia coffee, which is twenty four point two ounces, is seven thirty five. Ooh, they have the Arizona green tea, lemon uh, iced tea mix. Oh, I love it! The Starbucks knockoff, the Barissimo iced coffee, French vanilla mocha, or coffee latte. Hmm. And remember the Nescafe. Remember what happened? Everybody was doing a Nescafe. Um, it was that. Um, that that fluffy dessert. Yeah, I heard about that. Like a coffee dessert with uh -huh. Nescafe? Yeah, but you put like a little whipped cream and then a sugar and then you just make that dessert. Everyone's doing that during the pandemic. Right. I, don't, I never got into that. Well, we use an instant coffee when we travel. Yes. Um, but I've never used instant coffee at home. Here's your tea bags. Not a bad price for those either. Mm -hmm. Green tea, dollar nineteen. Black tea, dollar eighty nine. Freeze pops. Ooh, it's on clearance too, honey. It's a clearance price. Four ninety nine for uh, how many? You get a hundred pops in there. That is still about five cents a pop. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A lot of juice selections. Kids drink packets. What is there in there? There's six of them. In yeah, it's like cents. it's like Kool Aid technically. Okay. Yeah, you add your own sugar. Here's another Aldi saver. Uh, iced tea with lemon. Uh, $1.79 normally, $1.50 now for an Aldi saver price. Below that, organic. Is that apple juice? Mm-hmm. And normally $3.39, they drop a dime to $3.29. Not much of a savings. But yeah, can you grab those actually, honey? Because the kids. Uh, they love juice boxes. Right. That's the fruit punch. We want the apple, right? So yes, the apple. I want the apple. Oh, it says apple or fruit punch, but I'll get the apple is what I want. That's fruit punch, too. So that's what I'll get is the apple. And you get eight of them. Mm -hmm. It's for the grandkids. Okay. They do like their juice boxes. And I'd rather get them that than the fruit punch juice boxes. Because there's no added sugar in it. Yeah. Then they have applesauce. You know, it's weird because I like uh, applesauce with my pork chops. And if you remember the, uh, I'm not going to tell you the episode. you got to tell me. Pork chops and applesauce. Pork chops and applesauce. So what show was that from? Yeah. If you could put that in the comments below, mm -hmm. we'd greatly appreciate it. I love applesauce with my pork chops. But it's got because, be, because but, of that show. Right, but it's got to be sweetened. It cannot yes. be unsweetened. Yeah, it's got to be the original. Well, it's kind of like these, but I get them the Mott's applesauce. I might try these, though. Oh, they have pineapple here, honey, for you, for your crock pot pulled pork. Right. So I s actually put pineapple slices or pineapple chunks into my crock pot when I pull up to my pulled pork barbecue. Well, they have two. They have the crushed pineapple, and they also have the pineapple chunks. Which one do you want to get? I want the one with the most pineapple in it, with juice in it. How many ounces is that? 20 yeah, ounces? 20 ounces. This is also 20 ounces, by the way. Well, just do the chunks versus crushed. You just want one? Mm-hmm. Okay. That's all we need. Dollar twenty-eight is not a bad price. Yeah, they don't have the slices. All they have is the chunks. Is that yeah. both slices? Where are the slices? Yeah, they have the crushed and they have the chunked. They don't have the slices. The last time we were here, we had the slices. So mm -hmm. I'm missing those. Well, that that would perfectly work. Yeah, maybe they're just out for right now. You know what we need, honey, is paper plates. Uh, we don't have any. And last time we were at Costco or Sam's, they didn't have the larger ones. I didn't know if you wanted to get them here or not. I mean, it's still a little on the pricey side. 
So it's up to you. Oh, why don't we do this one? The Boulder 1 or 100 count plate. We don't need the really, really big ones. We just need these. Yeah, that's we true. We actually have styrofoam plates, but the problem with styrofoam plates, you can't microwave it. No. Let's get these. These are 429 for that. You get 100 mm -hmm. plates there. We'll see how they are. Compared to Dixie, it says on there. <laughs> it we'll should see. be coated because that's the whole thing about coated plates is that it doesn't leak when you put something greasy on it. Mm -hmm. That's what we need. So the Boulder 4-2 roll is for 29 for 316 sheets. The, uh, what is that, the 6 roll, that's 649. 699. I'm sorry. Six, oh, 649 for 649. Yeah, 649 for 696 sheets. Yeah, for the 6 roll pack. And then the 2 roll, 232 sheets is 245. So the cheapest one actually would be the bottom one. Well, actually, no, that one, but it depends how big the sheets are. Well, they have a they have a 12 roll over here. That's 12.99 for the 12 roll. Yeah, but if you look at the sheet, it's 1.04 per sheet, so it's actually technically cheaper. It all depends on how big the sheet is. Mm -hmm. You have to be really careful with this on the sheet size because sheets can be smaller. Yeah, we've kind of found that uh, we gravitate either towards the uh, Members Mark or the uh, Kirkland brands from Costco or Sam's Club because they're as good as like Bounty, uh, but a lot cheaper. And don't forget, it's as kids are back to school, do check your prices on sandwich bags. You know who's got a uh, who's got a sale on uh, sandwich bags right now? One of the uh, one of the uh, warehouse clubs. I can't remember. It's Costco. Costco. Sam's. Costco's got it. Yeah. With the Ziploc. They've got a sale on Ziplocs right now. And here's a link to the video, so you can see it. Aldi's does have a pretty good selection of meats at pretty good prices. And a lot of times they'll have a, like a flash sale, which we've never been lucky enough to take advantage of because whenever they have one of that goes really fast. Oh, did you check this? They are limiting chicken. Oh, to limit two? I didn't see that. Yeah, limit two for two eighty nine a pound. That's actually a really good price. I think we still have some in the freezer right now, but that's still a really good price. Do you want to pick up a package? No, we have it in the freezer, remember? That's what I thought. We try to keep a lot of stuff in the freezer when we buy on sale. Yeah. And I have found that their steaks are actually pretty darn good. Mm -hmm. um, so, and if you can get them like at a good price, you which is what which is what we look for. Right, well usually around the holiday time, they have basically their steaks on sale or the rib roast on sale. And we have gotten it as cheap as like six ninety nine a pound for like ribeye, mm -hmm. or the roast like six ninety nine or seven ninety nine a pound. Well, there's a couple of Aldi savers that they've got going on here. Not a big savings, but they've got an eye of round steak. Uh, dime off on that, so they'll drop to five thirty nine a pound. Then they also have a country style ribs. They're going to drop that forty cents from seven ninety nine seven seventy nine to seven thirty nine. So you look for the Aldi savers is what you want to look for. But also compare them to prices like at your local supermarkets like Kroger or Meyer or whatever your local supermarket is because they sometimes have sales on steaks too. And a lot of times your local supermarkets are going to be cheaper than Aldi. So ch check your prices. We were at, uh, was it Sam's Club? And the cost of a 12 pack, I'm sorry, a 35 pack of Coke products, not Pepsi products, but Coke products just in the last week has gone up two bucks for a 35 pack. These are the 12 packs of Coke. 12 packs, 678 for a 12 pack. Right now it's nobody's got it on sale in our area. But we we normally see it either three for what twelve ninety nine or four for twelve ninety nine. But wait until Labor Day. It, it was usually Coke and Pepsi products on sale. Mm -hmm. With these prices, I feel like I'm in Florida. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll tell you right now, the Meyer ad came out today, and I haven't had a chance to look at it. I want to see if Meyer has soda on sale this week. We do need eggs, and I do want to check the price of eggs, honey. We found the best price for eggs so far has been here at Aldi. And $1.95 a dozen. 
is pretty much the best price in town for us, so we're going to get some. We just need a dozen. Just a dozen? Mm -hmm. That's a, those are good. Yep, those are good. So that's the best price in town right now for a dozen eggs yeah, here at Aldi. So the eggs are one ninety five. The milk is three oh five. Which is a dime cheaper than maybe a dime or maybe twenty Wait, cents cheaper. Fourteen cents cheaper. Fourteen than cents it. cheaper than Kroger. Yes. Okay. I knew it was cheaper, but I couldn't remember just exactly how much. So let's see what they've got in the Aldi saver aisle. The Isle of Shame. Those are uh, storage buckets. $9.99. Good price. Oh, I like this. It's a little pricey, but this is pretty cute. Look at that. Oh, these ratons. I love these, too, because you can put stuff on top of them. They won't slide off. Mm -hmm. And you could hide stuff like your kid's toys in it. Mm -hmm. A little pricey. I think it's a... Uh... What, $49.99? No, I don't see the pricing on that. That's that... not right. Oh, that's the chair. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. not the price on the... I don't know what the price is. Does it say? Oh, there it is. Yeah, $39.99. Right there. Right there. By my foot. I guess you could do this for indoor and outdoors if you really mm -hmm. want to. Yeah. You just bought a composter. How much did you pay for our composters? Um, $39.99? Yeah, $49.99 for those. Want a scissor set? $7.99. Four-piece scissor set. Oh, I like that. They have cards. Did you see that? What's that? Pink flamingos. No, that's oh. a peacock. But there's a pink flamingo there. There is. Look at that. $19.99. You can have a flamingo. You can have a crane. I think can, we a crane. Put a, can we put a pink flamingo in our yard? I heard pink flamingos are really popular. I, I, I yeah, okay. I'm, I'm joking, actually, to be honest with no, you. No, I heard they're really popular. I'm joking about getting one, though. But I like the fact they actually have birthday cards. Actually, mm -hmm. I think we need to get one, don't and we? thank you cards, too. And thank you, yes. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. You going to party like it's your birthday. Yeah, birthday cards are so expensive. I love the fact that they do have them cheaply here for $1.49. It's your birthday. Oh, I like that one. Slice, slice, baby. Ha, ha, ha. And that would be our kid right there, Slice Slice. May your day be filled with pizza. I like that one. Oh, I like this one too. To all the best wishes. Why don't we get that one? Happy cake day? Yep. Okay. How much is it? $1.49. forty-nine. We may want to pick up more than just a few because these are great prices for birthdays. Because we do have a couple birthdays coming up, you know? Mm-hmm. Oh, I like that one too. Yeah, birthday... Uh, birthday cards, any kind of cards right now are just so darned expensive. Oh, for buck forty nine. And these are actually pretty decent cards. Yeah, too. and also if you like, actually they're die cut in front. I'm pretty impressed with this. Some of them are. There's another one. We have a few birthdays coming up. That's why. Yes, true that. I still like this one here. Which one? Where, 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 where to go? That one right there. Slice, slice, baby. I do like that one. I like this. This is like fifteen bucks, fourteen ninety nine. That is basically the squishmallow sh knockoff. Yeah. Only at Aldi. Back to school, BPA free square snack bags. Those are what cheese. That looks like those, those, those look like Cheez Its. Cheez Its, yeah. But they're just snack bags. Interesting, they even have briefs here eight pack boys or ten pack girls underwear. Yeah, ten bucks, not a bad price. And the way kids go through underwear when they're young. Oh, this is interesting. The work storage station. I guess you could put your computer on this. That's way, or, or on it or in it. Right. Store it in it, but you can use it on it. It's got a little lip there to hold it. Oh, I like that. So, what's this bag though? This is like that's a, a chunk organizer or cooler right here. Oh, okay. That's this one. That goes in your trunk. Mm-hmm. Interesting. And you could detach that, detach the cooler. Okay. Fifteen bucks, not a bad price. 
And here's another one, the ergonomic laptop stand for $29.99. Yeah, it's gone down in price. And also the gel seat cushion. I've been trying to get comfortable in the right seat on my car. Still haven't been able to. Have to find a perfect pillow. I like this. The Which one? Little, uh, what do they call them? Furniture character stools. Stools, yeah. 20 bucks for those. Again, for your kidlets. Oh, the personal fan, honey. We yeah. all need fans. Yep, $12.99 for that. That's a great price for that. You want some? Go ahead. Did you see this one? The, oh, the foldable photo. storage ottoman. Ooh, I like this one. I do like this one. Interesting. Make yourself a table. Can you grab that one? $12.99. Which color do you want? That one. That one there? Uh-huh. Okay. Is that the only one? I would I should try to get two of them. That's the only gray one. Yeah, I'm going to go with gray. Do you see this up here? Play-Doh. I used to play with Play-Doh all the time growing up. Four forty nine for Play-Doh spring packs. But you can make your own Play-Doh, you know. I know. And I know parents who have done that, too. There's one of your foldable laundry baskets. I think it was cheaper at, I think, Costco or Sam's Club. Mm -hmm. $14.99 for that. Storage cart? No. Forty nine ninety nine for the storage cart. There's one next to it too uh, for shoe uh, shoe rack for twenty nine ninety nine. And the yellow boots. Oh, my grandson loves his yellow boots. What else have we got here? Electric spreader. A little bit late in the season for an electric spreader. Yeah, two. And what is this? This is a lemonade stand. Ah. Interesting. <laughs> I don't know how much it is because I don't know where they are. Somebody just put it here, but <laughs> this is great for Disney. And they got lighters. Uh, there it is. It's eight ninety nine. Yeah, right here. Eight ninety nine. Great for Disney. Portable table, four foot portable table. How much is that? Twenty nine ninety nine. They've got some great finds here this time mm -hmm. around. The air bed for $24.99. Um, and the 20. four, there's two of them. There is a, an Intex Queen air bed for $24.99 and a Venture Ridge air bed for $22.99. I think it's just a different brand. We have one of these. It's a different brand, but that's a good price for that. You put one in your car, you really do need it. Yes, we do really suggest that because we've had a lot of flat tires, haven't we? Uh, unfortunately, yes. Um, those come in really handy because I think they plug into your cigarette lighter. Uh, ours does anyway, and I think this one does too. Yeah, it's a cigarette lighter. Just plug it into your cigarette lighter and charge your... Uh, and, uh, and then you can uh, put air in your tires. The Smithsonian Education Rug for nineteen ninety nine. We have a bigger version, which you got at, I think, Costco. Mm-hmm. And and we, we got like a year and a half ago. I really love it. And don't forget your bed pillows. Five ninety nine for a bed pillow. I want to see what's in the next dial over. A pretend and play set. Only thirteen bucks, twelve ninety nine. <laughs> there you go, honey. Is that a um, format? It's a format, yeah. It's a format. That is not an indoor tent. That's a floor mat. Yeah. There's a five inch fan for 10 bucks. Um, comforters? Yeah, $26.99 for the comforter. Do we need a step stool? No, that's a squatting stool. That's a um, knockoff of. Um, uh, a certain. Okay. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I know where you're. I know where you're going with that. Yeah. Bathroom organizers. Mm -hmm. Sheet sets. What is that? Pet shower spray. Oh, that's really interesting. For your pets to wash your pets. It's only. Nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. A lot of pet stuff here. Car seat cover. 
This is great when you have children in the back seat because they'll protect your seats. Mm -hmm. If you, that's only if you have captain's chairs. Why would anybody want an LED curtain light? Oh, for kids and going back to school. Okay. And college rooms, college dorms. Okay. Fresh face cloth. Lots of clothing and lots of shoes. Two-pack leggings. That's a good price for a two-pack. Hmm. Bike we got shorts. the uh, jersey shorts, the bike mm -hmm. shorts, uh, six ninety-nine for those. So these are the Aldi finds. Yeah, they have two aisles of them here. Um, you just got to go through. They change constantly from the different things that you can buy. This is what they've got in our Aldi this week. We found a lot of cool things here at Aldi today, didn't we? Yes, we did. I love the birthday cards and that stool. Yeah, here, let me show you that stool real quick. This the was ottoman. cool. This was cool. This is a foldable storage ottoman. Um, and what we're going to use it for is uh, toys um, for our kid, grandkids' toys to uh, store some of the toys in. And just put it off to the side so they're not all over my living room, which they are right now. But it, I don't. The kids play with them, so that doesn't bother me in the least bit. We found the birthday cards. Um, you've got your animal crackers, uh, strawberries we picked up, mm -hmm. um, and a couple of other things. We did find some really, really good finds on prices here this week at Aldi's. Um, eggs, um, best price on eggs in our area anyway right now uh, here at Aldi's, and milk cheaper than uh, Kroger. So. Uh, there you go. Great finds at Aldi's today. And again, we don't come up to Aldi's every now and then, or all, all the time, about every maybe month, month and a half or so, right? About every three to four weeks, yes. Yeah, about yeah, about every month, month and a half or so. So we like checking it out because the Aldi finds, those two aisles, um, affectionately, and I, I say affectionately known as the Isle of Shame, um, changes constantly, and we find some good things in there too. So check those out when you go to Aldi's. Check it out, the uh, Aldi Savers aisles. Thanks for watching the video. Appreciate you checking it out. As always, uh, hit that subscribe button below if not, uh, if you've not already done so. Also, the bell notification button below because that'll get you notified when we put up future videos. I would love for you to hit the like button too because that helps us out immensely. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, you can save you a little bit of money at Aldi's this week and have yourself a magical day.